the solution to this chart so in this case what we've got is we want to have some information here we want to tick or cross depending if the total for that particular quarter adds up to more than 32 million so we're going to create an if function so the first part is relatively easy we're going to do an if and we're going to say please check the sum of the next three months is it bigger than 32 million for example one two three one two three if it's true we're going to want to tick and for now I'm just going to put the word tick in if it's false we want to cross so that's going to say tick or cross but now we actually want to see the tick or cross you've got to be careful with messing around with fonts in a chart so easier way is go and find a tick so I've got a tick there I highlight it I'm going to copy it escape out of it go into my if function and where the word is tick I'm just going to highlight it and paste that tick in click enter same thing here go find a cross that I like so maybe it's that one there copy it escape out go back into my if statement and replace word cross with that cross click enter you'll see I've now got a cross I'm just going to copy and paste these to all the relevant areas and you'll see I now get ticks and crosses depending on the answer okay and now it's just a case of setting up your chart again so all we're going to do is highlight the data in certain area stacked area just make it a bit wider so we can see a bit better and fix the horizontal axis and tell it that it mustn't just look there it must look at all those and when I say OK you'll see that now our ticks and crosses appear under here and you can then work through moving around the the legends and putting the drop lines in and fixing the axes.